Hi, this is Andy, and I just wanted to share with you today my newest bottle that I painted with mandala dots, my little flowers, and a little Volkswagen bug. Going back to the flower power, <laughs> 1960s. But my biggest thing I'm really excited about are my tassels with the embellishments. And these are made out of the pop cans with glitter paper on top. And also, there's flowers that I did with a half of a pearl in the center. And I used the glitter on the back. And this one, I just used computer paper. As you can see, this gives it a real nice, sturdy, backing for that glitter paper and you can bend it to the way you want it and it stays put. The metal from the pop can does crimp the paper along with the metal so the edges are not really sharp. They're not one you'd want to rub your finger across but they are pretty good. They're crimped out pretty nice. But I thought this was really neat because unlike just paper, these you can move it and it'll stay put. Like with your butterfly, if you want it to have the wings look like they're flapping. So I'm going to show you how I did this because most of your glitter paper is not going to have a self-adhesive backing. So you're gonna take your can, and what I found works the best is the double-sided scotch tape. It's very strong, really, really great tape. And you wanna just butt that right up to each row. Put that on your tin, and you wanna make sure you cover that really, really well. So, you get your scotch tape on there, you take your glitter paper, put that over, let me see if I can do this a little bit better. So, you put that over it, and I want to do the bunny. So, I'm going to put this in here. thinking correctly. We, I'm going to do this through the cuddle bug. And I believe all I need, nope, I'm going to need two sheets, two of the thin. And that'll go right through the cuddle bug and give me a nice cut. I'm going to run it right back through. Let's see. Nope, don't need to. One cut, one cut did it. So here I have my bunny, all sparkly, and it's crimped. Everything is good. Now this bunny can bend, be a little bit more flexible, and would fit perfect on a bottle or in your scrapbook, whatever you want to do with it. You can find all kinds of different things to use these embellishments. But I just thought it was a neat idea. Even if you don't like glitter and you want to use some other cardstock, I find glue, it just does not work as well. But your Scotch double-sided tape does wonders and it really, really works out nice. So, thought I would share that with you. And I've got to show this bottle. Now see, isn't that the sweetest thing? Well, you can also look up my tassels. I just put a tad of hot glue to attach that to the tassel. And the same with this here. And uh, I really think they're cute. 
just really adorable. They add a nice touch to the bottles. So you have a wonderful day. Any questions, please leave them in the comments. I'll see what I can do to get an answer to you. Um, if you like the little tips and ideas that I keep posting on YouTube, please give me a thumbs up. Let's me know I'm doing a good job. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. And thank you very much. Bye.